This is a, a vessel that I turned out of some curly eucalyptus. Now, curly eucalyptus, I figured that's going to be a very tough wood to turn, but I was actually surprised that it, it, it actually cut quite nicely. I, uh, I wanted to do a gilded and patinaed surface on it, but I also wanted people to know that this was one solid block of wood. So what I did was this sort of a harlequin pattern. And the way that I created this was to turn the vessel and then to uh, get some finish on it, a couple of coats of lacquer. Then I remounted it on the lathe, just using a cup center on, on both sides. And then I used the indexing head to step off 16 points on the top and 16 points on the bottom. Then took a flexible straight edge, laid it diagonally, and then just basically connected the dots. And um, I used that pattern to, to cut out that pattern with a, a masking material. And then with the masking material, I was able to protect the background. And then when I cut and remove the masking material, then I could gild and patina these spots and have a, a very dramatic look to it. I mean, the, uh, the points are really quite accurate and it's really quite pronounced when you look at the, the curl of the eucalyptus in the background. I especially love some of the patterns on the uh, gilded areas. You can see close up here how uh, some of that uh, patina really comes out with the silver leaf. And these are all techniques that students will learn in our, our turning and gilding class.